Um, yes, we need to start flooding the- Oh, oh gosh! Oh my goodness! Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I am back in Roblox, and today we are playing Shipping Lanes. So yeah guys, let's get into the video. Now, here we are in game, and as you can see, this is my vessel. This is the MV Gillette 2. As uh, I originally started out with a starter ship, um, just to kind of get the, uh, the basics of the game. And uh, basically, this game is all about transporting cargo without sinking or damaging your vessel. And uh, that's what we're going to try to do today. Now, I've got a bit of money because, of course, I went around and did a bit of uh, sailing in-game. And uh, I did do some cargo transport, and uh, that's why I have this much money. But, uh, yeah, a lot of people requested this game to be played. And, uh, yeah, I do enjoy it, so we're going to be playing it here. And, um, yeah, I hope that guy doesn't hit us there. But uh, we better slow down just a little bit here. Because we don't want to collide uh, with the cranes here. So let's just kind of maneuver ourselves into position here. Alright, that should be good. And let's go ahead and use the bow thrusters here. That's E on the keyboard to maneuver into place. Move forward just a little bit until the bridge is just near the crane. And then that should be good. Oh, don't collide, don't collide, don't collide. And crunch. Alright, there we go. So let's go ahead and dock the vessel. And there we go, so we're docking the ship, and once this is loaded, we have our options to load cargo onto the ship. Alright, so we're going to click Manage Cargo, and uh, we're looking for the most expensive payout. So let's take a look here, and um, yeah, it looks like this one here uh, for the Norfolk port, and um, that's just up here, so that's kind of all the way around the map. We are here at Newport, and Norfolk is up here, so we're going to go ahead and load up all this cargo so here we go you can see the cargo being loaded on board the vessel and there we are perfect so now we have to go back go to ship services and refuel the vessel there we go we click exit undock the ship and now we are ready to uh sail to norfolk and there we go so let's go ahead use our bow thrusters to get us away from the dock and then well, well apparently i jumped out of my seat there Let's go ahead and hop back in, and then we're going to turn the vessel around like this, and then just accelerate and start moving. All right, and here we go. We are heading to Norfolk, and I think we can just cross through here. Um, oh, wow, that is a really large ship that just spawned next to me there. Okay, wow. All right, so let's go ahead and get sailing here. So, um, yep, here we go. All right, so this is the plan. This is us here. We're going to go through the harbor here into Stanley Harbor through the first lock, through the channel, through the second lock, and into Norfolk Port. So that is the plan. So let's go ahead and maneuver the vessel so we can enter the port. So uh, I believe there's a ship dock there. Oh, it's a small ship, so that's good. But uh, here we go. Let's go ahead and uh, get this thing moving. Looks like we have another ship behind us here, so uh, we shouldn't slow down because uh, we don't want them to crash into us here. And this guy's going to go around us here, so... Uh, Yep, there he goes. Oh, actually, I think he's trying to get to the lock as well. Oh, I don't think so, sir. Oh, crunch. Uh, sir, I came here first. There we go. That should have resolved the situation. Okay, um, we are getting really close to the, uh... Oh, crap. Ooh, yeah. Luckily, we didn't take too much damage. But, uh, there we go. Alright, so let's go ahead and go into the lock here. Uh, we just had to position ourselves and figure out how this system works. Okay, request to open the lock here. So now we just have to wait. All right, there we go. All right, the lock has been opened and we are sailing through. And I don't know how this guy got on my ship, but that's quite interesting. Um, yes, we need to start flooding the... Oh, oh gosh. Oh my goodness. Well, that guy's in the water now, but, uh, I see a few issues with what I've just done here. Um, well, it's somewhat sunken and mostly out of the water, and, um, yeah, this is, uh, not the greatest thing that could happen. Um, so, yeah. 
And we're back with the MV Gillette 2. Sadly, we did have an incident, as you just saw there, but we're going to try for a successful mission now. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and dock up here. We just need to uh, turn the ship. I'm actually going to be um, facing the wrong way, but I don't really care because I'm going to be here for a very short amount of time just to load up on cargo. So, uh, yeah, hopefully no one sees. But let's go ahead and drop the throttle. Get the bow thrusters. Let's go in full reverse here. Oh, no, don't hit the rocks. Not again. Don't do this. Don't do this. Okay, perfect. All right, so there we are. Okay, so now we just need to go in reverse and dock up the vessel here. Oh, look at that. It's the starter ship. What does he have planned? Not much, it looks like, but uh, here we go. Okay, perfect. And let's go ahead and just... Move back just a little bit here. Oh, bumping alongside. And there we are. All right, so let's go ahead and dock up here. There we are. And there we are. Okay, so let's go ahead and manage some cargo. Let's pick the largest payout here. Oh boy, a million dollars. That is looking good. Let's load up with that. We have to go to Davenport. So we will see where that is on the map. Now, you can get faster um, liners or ships, but they're actually smaller, so they carry less cargo. But there we go, so let's see where Davenport is. Okay, so it's the icy area, so it shouldn't be too far away since we are in uh, Norfolk, and we just have to go around here to Davenport right here. So let's go ahead and uh, ship services, refuel the vessel. There we go, and undock the ship. So here we go. This guy is going in circles, and he just slammed into a rock. Good for him. So here we go. Let's get out of here. And now we are on the move. So I need to make a U-turn, and then uh, we're just going to head into open waters. Well, we're looking good so far, and uh, well, well, it looks like somebody just had a collision with us there. Well, this guy is unrelenting. He is continuing to follow us here. I'm unsure for what purpose. He doesn't even have any cargo on board, but let's go down the stairs here, or not. Um, very interesting, but there is a teleport to ship function, which allows for us to jump back on the ship just in case something like this happens. Oh no, my ship is sailing off into the distance. Help me. Or not. Well, it looks like the sun is gonna be coming up in a moment or two, I think from that direction, but we will see. We are making another course change here to head towards the uh, the icy biome in the game, or Davenport, and that is just over there, and we should see the sun coming up very soon. And here comes the sun, so uh, it wasn't from that direction, it's from this direction. So yeah, very cool, and I believe there's a bank on that small island too, so that's pretty cool. And look, another ship is going to be passing us soon here, so let me go over to the bridge wing, and uh, we might see it here, but there it is. Right where my cursor is, right there. Very cool. Looks like this person is also carrying cargo, so I don't think they're going to be crashing into anybody uh, just for fun. So yeah. All right, so we have lined ourselves up here to head into the port. As you can see, we're just going to be sailing straight ahead, and then we're going to dock here. Very cool. All right, so we are really getting close here, and uh, oh, looks like there's two vessels following me here. Um, that's quite interesting. Uh, let's go ahead and see uh, what they're doing. Oh, yeah, there they are there. Um, they're getting quite close quite fast here. I think they're uh, just turning away, so that's good. We don't want any collisions anytime soon, do we? So, uh, yep, we're almost into the port here. We're actually entering the ice area, so let's go ahead and sound the horn. There we go. That should be good. Oh, yeah, this vessel is uh, passing us here. It looks like the U.S. Navy. That's quite interesting. We better turn a little bit. There we go. Sound our horns there. And uh, we're going to dock up where these cranes are because everything else is not for cargo. So, yeah, there goes the U.S. Navy passing us there. All right, let's sound the horn there. And um, here we go. It looks like they're going to dock up as well. So there should be enough room for both of us. But uh, here we go. So we're going to need to pull an impressive maneuver to actually get into position here. So we're going to throw the ship into reverse. And I'll explain why we're going to do that in a second. But uh, here we go. And it's fully in reverse. We're going to use bow thrusters. And we are going to swing the vessel around like this. And that reverse motion is going to prevent us from over swinging and uh, moving forward. Then we're going to cut the reverse motion. And uh, then 
we're just going to let the rotational force here move us into position. And then we just use bow thrusters and just slide into the port. So uh, here we go. Oh wow, that uh, that is quite interesting over there. Two ships on the ice and then a large ship incoming. But uh, yeah, here we are and we are about to dock up here. All right, and here we go and we are about to dock. And that should be good. Okay, let's dock the vessel and unload this cargo. All right, so let's go ahead and switch to unload mode and unload containers. There we go. And uh, yeah, there we are. It is unloading the containers and um, that will be it. All right, my ship is uh, leaving me here, but uh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like and a comment and I'll see you next time, guys. Goodbye.